Welcome to Loyola Tutoring's Gate Sample Test Series. My name is Melvin, and today we'll be going through abstract reasoning. All right, question number three. Another complete the pattern question. So taking a look at this question, we have a series of different features. So we have circles some of the times, we have crosses some of the times, we have the stars, the squares, the cross already, and then we have this octo octagon shape, and then we also have this ninja star shape. All right, so how do we do a question like this? You do this question the same way you eat an elephant, right? Have you guys heard of that expression? You eat an elephant by taking one bite at a time, right? Or Rome wasn't built in a day, it was built brick by brick. Or a journey of a thousand steps starts with just one. I think I messed that up, but it doesn't matter. I think you guys get the idea. You choose any one of the features and you try to figure out, that, out the pattern for that and that will help you solve the next one and the next one. So let's take a look at favorite feature, circle here. So let's take a look at how the circle's moving. Clearly, the circle's not going across the row. It's only visible in the left column. And in the left column, it goes minus one, minus one. Okay, that makes sense. Let's take a look at the cross. The cross is going across the row and it's going minus one, minus one. I'm starting to see a pattern here. The pattern that I'm seeing is that a feature will only go down the column or across the row, meaning that in any given image, there will only be two features. One feature that has been going down and one feature that's going across. So looking at the last image, we know that there has to be a ninja star at the bottom and going across, there will be an octagon. So straight away, we can cancel out A, cancel out B, cancel out D and left with C. And that's the smart way of doing it really quickly. But let me just prove it to you that that's exactly the right answer as well. So looking down, the ninja star is going minus one, minus one, and the ninja star should be at the bottom left here. Sorry about the drawing. And then that is correct in C. And looking across, the octagon is going plus one, plus one, and it's also at the bottom right position. So C, in both ways of figuring it out, is the correct answer. All right, that's it for the first set of abstract reasoning questions, one to three.